Cherise Nicole with Scenicy.com. I'm here once again with Kobe Bell, who is one of my favorite characters on television, one of our favorite characters on television. Okay. This season on The Game. Okay, I've been watching since season one. Mm-hmm. I'm completely invested. Nice. I'm on the edge of my seat. Kelly's back. Yeah. What the heck? It is, it's about time, first of all. Yeah, it is. It is. It's, it's a big deal. Yeah. It's a really big deal. And, um, I mean, I, it's, for me, it's just cool having you know having Brittany back just just to hang out with. You know, I I, I missed her, um, but yeah, for the show, it's it's huge. You know, now everything that's going on with with Jason and Chardonnay, and then to have Kelly back in the mix, that's just I'm excited to watch it. Well, um, I feel like you're in a Donnell Jones situation. You don't know where you want to be. I mean, what's going on? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It, it's um, I mean, first of all, I think it's, it's just a genius move. By the writers, you know, just to, just to just to mix it up like this, and I mean, as we saw from the from the premiere, um, it's, it's it's like every choice and mistake Jason's ever made is coming back to to get him to get him. So we started right off with the steroids thing, um, at his jer- Jersey retirement, which was so much fun, and then and then boom, and then Kelly's back. Yeah, it's like it's the whole world is flipped upside down can't mention the steroid thing without me wondering do you think like the whole steroid thing coming back at you at your highest moment right. is karma for how mean Jason has been <laughs> that's a good way of looking at it well let's let's talk about wives you know do you ever think Jason could be in a big love situation you know the polygamy and have both Kelly and well the, I, we have to announce that um <laughs> season eight they all moved to Utah so Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Okay, so Kelly would be the first wife. Brandon would be the sister wife. <laughs> yeah. Which one would birth the children? Yeah, yeah. Which one would turn the butter? <laughs> I don't even want to know. I don't want to know. So let's talk about the two of them. Which one of them has the biggest mouth? Biggest mouth, yeah. character-wise, or 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 out of Brittany and and Brandy? I want to hear both. <laughs> I, I Brandy. Yeah. <laughs> Easily, okay. easily, okay. easily on for both. <laughs> what is that show going to be called? I, just, I, I don't know. I got to think about that one. <laughs> I'm going to coin it so that I can get 10% when the show happens because that would be really interesting yeah. to see y'all in a polygamous situation. Maybe just the pits. <laughs> okay, right? Okay, yes, yes. No, that's not actually happening. I'm now, we got to see the show get canceled. We were devastated. I was one of the people that write in. I never write in, but I wrote in about right. that. Right. And, um, you know, and then it came back. It was revived. So tell me, what did the cancellation and the revival of the show teach you about yourself and about the industry? Man, um, well, I mean, I knew it was, you know, that's, that's, that's part of the deal with TV. You know, it's uh, it's harder to get a show on than it is to have it not be on, yeah. you know. So, um so I was kind of at peace with the, you know, with, with it, with the show ending because I, that's just the nature of the business. But I, I gotta say, I wasn't ready for it to be done mm-hmm. when the, the first, you know, after the first three seasons, I was having so much fun. I really loved playing this character. I loved everyone I'm, I was working with. So it was like a perfect work situation. Right. Um, so I felt like it was over too soon. So then when it, when it came back, I was incredibly happy, yeah. incredibly happy. Yeah. Well, so were we. Fans felt completely incomplete when Kelly left. Now that she's back, we're wondering, what do you feel was left unsaid with her? Man, that is a good question. Yeah, I don't know. You know, I guess, you know, when, when Kelly and Jason were breaking up, they, well, they kind of went back and forth um, so much. I guess so that was season three. You know, Kelly wanted it to be over and Jason wanted her back and then when Kelly wanted Jason back, he didn't want her. Right. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I guess that's what's left. I mean, I guess I guess they they obviously still had feelings for each other. So, but then life moves on, yeah. and, you know, and Jason's in love again. So, and then when she comes back, it's it complicates things. Back those old feelings. You want that old thing back, possibly? <laughs> yeah, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I'm not trying to get you to say it, but I'm trying to get you to say it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's complicated. Mm-hmm. You got to watch. You definitely have to watch. Facebook status, it's complicated. It is. It is. I'm, I'm, yeah, exactly. Right? Exactly. I know that you guys all have a lot of fun on set. Would you like to see the whole cast back together again, like the whole gang? 
Oh, with 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 Pooch and Tia. Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. I mean, we're all so close at this point. It's like we're like family. So yeah, I'm, I'm I miss them. Um, and I mean, I mean, I, I you know love love Jay, love Lauren. They've added you know such great things to the show, and they're great people. And, they, and we you know they're part of the family now too. But um, definitely miss miss Tia and Pooch. So yeah, hopefully you know hopefully one day we'll all get back together. You got divorced from Kelly, and then you got married. Like I know in Mexico it was a drunken night or whatever, yeah. something like that. Do you think that? He needed more time to be single. Do you think that Jason needed to sow his royal oats a little more? I don't know. I don't know. I've 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 uh, I've never been single. <laughs> I mean, when I you know when I was in college or whatever. But you know, wait a minute, I've been, wait, a minute wait a minute. You personally have never been single. Well, I mean, I've been I've been married for what thirteen years. So oh yeah, we got married in oh one. So. Was that right out of college? I was like, I was like 26 when we got married. Yeah. So you don't even know what it's like to sow your royal oats. No, no, no. 